so I shovel rocks all day just to get my wages. I'm sick of aching and I'm sick of the pain created. I'm sick of aging and I'm sick of the devastation. I'm sick of blazing and I'm sick of the vegetation. I'm sick of aiming to push my career to a higher spot. I rhyme it hot, but the industry's turned to grime and pop. My mind is Sup guys and welcome back to another one. My name is Stealth and today I will just be explaining um, how a subscriber won my FN2 and reasons as to why I'm selling it and what the plans are next. So as you know I absolutely love that car. It has done more than what a car does for people obviously it started the channel tell a light didn't start the channel uh, my brother's ep2 the silver one if you've been a fan from back in the day that started the channel um but the stealth the stealth fn2 kind of allowed it to just take take shape and grow and i'm ever thankful for the car to that and i wouldn't know probably most of you guys if i didn't have that car and a lot of you guys i'm very grateful to know so as you know, um, a couple of months ago, I decided I was going to sell my car. I didn't quite know what I wanted to do. I was just getting a bit fed up with being stuck in a rut with it. I wanted to split most of my time between track days and um, and then the other half of my time managing things with work. And I just kind of appreciated that the FN2 does everything so well. It's just moving forwards. I think it was just time for somebody else to own it. Um, I mean, Hondas will always be in my life. And I kind of thought at some point I'm going to either sell that car or have to spend a lot of money making it into what I want it to be. And I didn't, I wasn't quite sold on wanting to do that. I didn't want to ruin the car. I wanted one of you guys, subscribers, to have it. Now, when I originally did the video, I just mentioned the highest bidder would get the car. All you had to do was follow me on Instagram, drop me a message. Now, I did have a, a fair few responses from that, but it was just quite hard to solidify a deal. And, you know, I might not look the sharpest tool in the box, but I'm quite uh, savvy when it comes to you know, making a sale, how to secure a deal, and not only that, making it the fairest. Now, a lot of you guys are, are quite confused about what actually happened. Did a subscriber win the car, or did you sell it through eBay? Now, like I say, I, I'm not daft. Um, a lot of offers were coming into my inboxes, but a lot of the time, it was just time wasters, and the only way to sift out those time wasters was to direct them to an advert that I put on eBay and just say, look, if you are serious, this is how you win it. Put in your bid through eBay. It was on buy it now or best offer. I did put it on quite high originally. I think I put it on at over six, but that was just to make sure that people were going to put bids in because, um, you know, you probably weren't going to buy it for, for six grand, even though to me, you know, I would have. It's such a nice car. It's gone down in history, I suppose. Uh, no, not really. Um, but, yeah, it's it, it's you know, I couldn't put a price on it. So what I was doing was I was redirecting people to the advert so that they could solidify a deal. And funny enough, those people that were messaging me on Instagram weren't actually putting uh, an offer in on eBay which just showed to me it was just um, they were just wasting time now I got a lot of messages just people being nosy and I just couldn't be bothered replying to half of them just like oh I thought you were giving it away why is it on eBay like I said I'm not daft um, I, you know it's, it's my car I'll, I'll do what I want to do with it and when it comes to selling it I never intended for it just to go just to anybody now half of the messages I got on eBay as well were People to say, keep it stealthy, uh, we love the channel, and it's just great that people recognise the car, recognise um, you know, the work I've done to it. Now, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to cut to a video of the person that actually bought the car. Now, when they actually contacted me, I was not 100% aware that they were a subscriber. However, 
the the car itself attracted subscribers to the channel and it just blew me away i couldn't believe how many people actually knew me through such a small youtube channel really now it was great um to meet the the new owner i'm not going to give any names away just yet and what i'm going to do is i'm going to cut to that in a minute but before i do i just wanted to say thank you guys for sticking with the channel as you know and i've probably already guessed I am staying Honda. I am probably going to reveal that in the next video as to why I have got what I'm going for. I did change my mind a few times. You know, there was a couple of things that I almost went for, but either the deal fell through because I, you know, I hadn't sold mine quick enough, or you know, the the people that I was dealing with. It's almost like they didn't understand that you know when you're selling something you've got to kind of be nice otherwise people aren't going to want to give you their money but i'll explain that in the next video so cut to the chase i'll cut to the video just remember guys keep it stealthy stay subscribed because you will see in the next video what i've gone for and that should be up in the next couple of days certainly within a week and it will be the start of some more consistent videoing as well. Alright, so before I start this video, I just want to give a big shout out to somebody who I always forget to give a shout out to. I've been meaning to do it for like a year. Um, he has supported the channel, he's created my logo, and he is a fellow YouTuber who is doing good things. And it's quite easy and the YouTube world to get jealous of people who are doing well and also who are doing similar content to you but what I love about uh, this person is they have you know quite you know they've, they've been quite supportive of me and what I do and I really do want to be supportive to to them because I absolutely love their channel it's great it's consistent and I could learn a few things from him so yeah FN Lou aka Lewis Humphreys big big shout out thank you for your support you took the channel to the next level with the logo and like i say i always tag it in on the end of all my videos because there's a split divide some people didn't uh preferred my old old intro but you know i wanted to keep that hard work that you put into making something for my channel and hopefully one day i can kind of repay that back to you so yeah thank you fn look i'm into hondas in it so <laughs> <laughs> right guys so today it's been an emotional an emotional day um, one of the subscribers has actually purchased the stealth the stealth on the Civic um, today is the, the last day that I will be in ownership of this car but I'm just so glad that it's actually gone to um, somebody who watches the channel supports the channel and hopefully we'll be on the channel again and turn up at a few meets in the car. Um, I'll just introduce you to him and his, him and his family who have come down. So she's the new owner. No, it's Sakib. Sakib. It's Sakib. Akib. Akib. Fishy. Fishy. Right, Wakab. Wakab. So yeah. So it's uh, that's it. The final the final drive for me. Um, you happy? Happy, yeah, I hope it's not the last time we see you. No, no. I have to invite you to some of the Honda gang Definitely. meets and stuff. Um, and yeah, like I've got a long. Uh, don't forget my hands on it. Do a few bits here and there. Yeah, do a few bits here and yeah. there. It's a good car, man. I mean, there's so Definitely. much on it. Um, I owe the car a lot. You know, to be honest with you, people. I was yeah. like really surprised it was Stealthy's car. Yeah. <laughs> not a chance before. Even my son's like was surprised yeah. as well. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> um, that's it. I mean, you've got like you've got the whole history of it now. Yeah. With it's the whole YouTube channel. That like, two so, years ago we started, and we knew nothing about cars. And now, what car? Rolling it. That's, yeah, it. Yeah, that's it. That's it. Yeah. So, so yeah, I'm gonna get a video of you guys rolling out, um, yeah. and then that's I might put some scenic, sad music in that. <laughs> um, but yeah, thanks guys. Uh, uh, that's it. Nice Happy days. Up. Happy people. <laughs> Lovely. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so.
Maybe don't forget to like, share and subscribe.